वेलकम एवरी वन टू आर चैनल कॉम्पिटिटिव पीडिया टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट नेशनल कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन डे सो लेट्स बिगिन सो विच डे इज सेलिब्रेटेड एज द कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन डे और संविधान दिवस ऑप्शन ए ट्वेंटी फिफ्थ नवंबर ऑप्शन बी ट्वेंटी सिक्स नवंबर ऑप्शन सी ट्वेंटी सेवेंथ नवंबर और ऑप्शन डी 28th November. The right answer is option B, 26th November. Now we now we have to see it in detail. It is 26th November. So 26th November is celebrated as Constitution Day or Samvidhan Divas in India. The day was earlier known as National Law Day. Clear? The central government on 19th of November 2015. declared 26th november as constitution day by a gazette notification now why the government has done this since 2015 was the 25th birth anniversary year of dr b r ambedkar so in order to celebrate that year in a big way the government has decided to change the name from national law day to constitution day or samvidhan divas Now, Dr. B. R. Ambedkar is known as the father of the Indian Constitution, and he was also the chairman of the drafting committee, which had seven members. Clear? Now, now, ne- now, next is, what is the significance of this day? Significance of the Constitution Day. The day commemorates the adoption of the Constitution of India, and to promote constitutional values among its citizens it was the day when the indian constitution was adopted by the constituent assembly in 1949 and it came into force on 26th of january 1950 so it was adopted by the constitution assembly in 1949 and it came into force on 26th of january 1950 clear now we are going to discuss about some important facts regarding our constitution indian constitution is the longest written constitution in the world and it is 30 times okay 30 times as long as american constitution we are celebrating our 72nd anniversary of constitution day in original form our constitution has 395 articles 22 parts and eight schedules clear and in its current form the constitution has 448 articles 22 parts and 12 schedules now the original constitution <coughs> was handwritten by prem bihari narain raizada in italic style he was a calligrapher and each page of the constitution was decorated by a team of artists from shanti niketan which was led by nandalal bose the constitution of india has gone through 104 amendments in 71 years so but uh, now we are going to discuss about some important amendments let's see in 1976 at the time of indira gandhi secular and socialist words were introduced in the constitution in 1989 the voting age was reduced from 21 to 18 years clear and in 2019 jammu and kashmir reorganization act was passed which bifurcated the region into two union territories clear so this was for for the day Thanks for watching the video till the end do subscribe our channel competitive pedia happy learning may god bless you all thank you